It's a nightmare for a traveling musician having their beloved instrument damaged beyond repair. It happened to a Brazilian musician traveling to Tel Aviv last week with her 17th century viola da gamba, worth more than $200,000. News Channel 5's Jesse Knudsen looked into ways to protect your instrument when you're flying here in the United States. Well, to avoid a horror story of flying with an instrument, you want to make sure that you do your research beforehand. Make sure that you know your instrument will fit on the plane, and regardless of whether you bring it on the plane or have to check it, make sure it's in a safe case. It's not uncommon to hear of instruments damaged while flying, but since 2014, there have been rules in place that try to help musicians. If their instrument fits in the overhead bin and they get on the plane early enough to where there is space in the overhead bin to put that instrument, they cannot be denied that right. Dave Pomeroy with the Musicians Association helped get those rules passed in Washington by explaining the issues musicians face. Musicians are business travelers. They just have funny looking briefcases. And, and that kind of resonated with them a little bit. Still, Pomeroy says it's incumbent on the musician to do their homework, like finding out which plane you're flying on to see what accommodations are available. If you search the model number of the plane, it will tell you what the size of the bins are. But even if you take all the steps you can to ensure your instrument's safety, accidents can happen. Usually, you're, you're more likely to be able to find a spot for it in the cabin if it's in a gig bag but then you, the risk is higher. Walter Carter at Carter Vintage Guitars has had plenty of airplane damaged guitars come in, even this guitar from country music star Chase Bryant. The top is cracked all the way up to here. He says there's no foolproof way to protect an instrument while traveling, but having the right case can help. You can stand on this one. Both Carlton and Hoffy cases can handle a lot. Yeah, it's, it's pretty solid. But in the end, traveling is a risk that many have to take in order to continue to entertain the world. In Nashville, Jesse Knudsen, News Channel 5. Thanks, Jesse. We've posted the full text of the FAA Modernization and Reform Act of 2012 on our website at newschannel5.com.